Hey, good morning, church. Uh, so grateful to come and spend a couple minutes with you talking about giving thanks, uh, prayers of thanksgiving. And where does that come from? Why are we called to give that? Well, the answer comes uh, in in 2 Corinthians chapter 9. Paul is is teaching the church at Corinth what it means to be thankful and why God blesses us so that we can bless others, and so he can be given the glory for the blessings that he's given. Listen to what he says in verse 11. He says, You'll be enriched in every way, but you'll be generous in every way, which through us will produce thanksgiving to God. Because of how he blesses us, we are then blessing others, and those individuals who we're blessing are going to give glory and honor to God for the blessings that he has given them through us. What an awesome God we serve. Listen to what he says also in verse 12. He says, For the ministry of the service is not only supplying the needs of the saints, but is also overflowing in many thanksgivings to God. God wastes nothing. He uses everything to bring about the results that he intends. And so he blesses us, we bless others, and not only are their needs met, but they then they, and in turn are allowed to give God thanks and, and glory to him and that allows them allows them to be blessed even further. So as we as we talk about prayers of Thanksgiving this week, I really want to encourage you um, to spend some time just saying thank you to God for the things he's given you. Whenever I pray, I try to pray uh, always pray, uh, you know, thank him and praise him for for being my father, for his son, for his spirit, for his word, for his church, for my salvation, for my family, for my family's salvation, for for my provisions, for uh, my health, for my ministry, for for those uh, inside the 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 ministry in the church. Just as many things come to my mind, um, I try to give him praise and honor for friends and, and so many who pour into me. And uh, and um, just really want to encourage you to to write a list down, make a list, and, and just thank him for as many things as you can think of. Also want to encourage you to um, to thank those who have blessed you because God has blessed them or give them the opportunity to bless you. And I uh, really want to say thank you to all those who who reached out to me and encouraged me after the sermon this week, for those who were blessed by it, for those who uh, were uplifted, however God used it, um, I, I, all glory and honor goes to Him. I really, really appreciate um, those who, who, who reached out, and it, it touches my heart. And I just want to give uh, Him all the glory and honor and thank you, uh, because it really is all about what He does. Uh, he gives me the message. He's the one that makes it resonate with folks. Um, he's the one who allows me to say it the way it's supposed to be said. And so just all praise and glory and honor goes to him for it. And the last thing I want to encourage you guys to do, so so give praise and honor to God. Thank those who blessed you. But I would encourage you to find somebody you can bless this week so that they can receive that same blessing of being able to go and say thank you to God for the things that he's done. Thank you to you for the things that you have done. It is a blessing to be able to say thank you. And to praise God for the incredible gifts that he's done. And, and I love the, the old line from scripture. As our Lord said, it's better to give than to receive. When we when we give thanks, that's one of the best gifts that we can do. Give thanks to God. Give thanks to those who have been there and taken care of us. And, uh, and give so that others can give thanks as well. I want to encourage you guys with that this morning. And I know this was kind of fast, but... Uh, Really just want to maximize the opportunity for you guys to spend some time in prayer and read that 2 Corinthians chapter 9, 6-15. through 15. It's a great text to help you see and understand how God does what He does. Hope to see you at church tonight. Y'all be blessed as you uh, spend some time in Thanksgiving today.